Alright, since we're here in the modem and Ethernet area, I'm going to show you how to remove and reinstall your SD card reader. So there's three silver screws there, here, and there. So we just remove those. Okay. Then you have this ribbon cable that connects to your motherboard. So you have two connectors, two little, you know, you just get in on the side of there, your uh, locking, uh, your lock there. And then you just, I like to slide it outwards away from the slot that it sits in. And there you are, and this also removes your Ethernet port. And then obviously if your Ethernet's not working, then you just simply unplug it from the board, grab your new Ethernet, plug it back in. Just, when I'm reinstalling it, I like to put the ribbon cable on first. So I slide the ribbon cable in, holding the board to create the pressure that I need so that it stays in there and I go to it. one side then the other and then there you are it's locked into place and you just slide that under there and to kind of see how it doesn't wobble when you it kind of locks in there so it doesn't move around too much and then you just replace your your screws Okay, so then you slide your, see, notice here how this, this, the bundle of wires is on top of it. You got to remove them aside. Drop your Ethernet in there. And this black cover that was on there has, I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a little leg here. Okay, maybe like that, maybe. This little leg here slides under the motherboard. So you put it in at an angle, dropping that under the motherboard. And that will sit in there nicely like that. And then you just shove the bundle of wires into the slot there. And there you have it. Removal and reinstallation of an S uh, the SD card reader and your Ethernet.